Welcome to Ralio AI. In this video, we'll show you all the places that you can find your new virtual assistant and how to get the most out of it. Let's dive in. The first place you'll find your AI assistant is in the post creator. So in your Ralio dashboard, you'll navigate to the content section and then click on the creator tab. We're gonna have our AI help us create a more engaging social media post. You'll find the AI button on the bottom right corner of your content creation screen. So the first thing we need to do is select an image to use. I'm gonna go ahead and click on images, then go to my images and select a picture from my database. I'm gonna use this one and then click use image. I'm going to first make sure that post to Facebook is checked so that I can see the post preview. Now we need to type something to give the AI an idea of what we want it to say. The more details you add, the better caption you'll get. This brand is a donut shop and cafe, so I could just write donut, but that's not gonna be very helpful. So let's go ahead and type some details about what's in our image. Now we could just leave it like that and publish our post, but it's not very engaging. So let's hand it over to the AI. I'm gonna click on the AI button and our AI screen will pop up on the right. The first thing we need to do is select the tone of our post. If we click here, we can see that we have a couple of different options. The tone is gonna help the AI write a better caption for your brand. I'm gonna stick with the friendly option for now and then select generate. As we scroll through, we can see that the AI took what we wrote and made a much more engaging caption. They included our brand name, emojis, and other details. I'm gonna choose this one here. We can see now that the caption we wrote has been replaced by the new caption, and it even includes some fun emojis. Now let's click over to hashtags and add some of the recommended hashtags. Once our post looks the way we want, we'll click done and then publish or save our post to the database. Next, we'll show you how you can have the AI create a new post for you. So once again, we're going to make sure that we're in the content section and then click into the post tab. So here we can see all of the posts that we've made or our team has made or a brand team has created for us. And we'll also see that when we hover over these posts, we have an AI icon in the top right. We can click that button and tell the AI to make us a post similar to one of the existing posts here. So let's do that. I'm going to select a post. So let's use this one and click the AI icon to generate a new similar post. Now we just wait a minute for the AI to work its magic. Remember, it's scanning the internet and your entire database to make sure it creates a great post for you. And there we are, with one click, we just made a whole new post and we didn't have to write a word. It created a caption, included relevant emojis, put in hashtags for us. It also selected an image from our library, but it also has other recommended images that we can use in addition to or instead of the selected image. I'm gonna add a few more of those now and then save as ready so I can post it whenever I choose. The third thing that Ralio AI will do for you is create content without having to ask. So again, we're gonna make sure that we're in the content section and then the post tab. We can see at the top that we have these boxes that give us information about our posts. How many do we have? How many are ready to be posted? How many drafts? How many need to be approved, etc. We now have another new box that says awaiting approval AI generated. Let's click into that to see what we have. Now we can see the posts that our AI has made for us based on our top performing posts from the week prior. Now we just have to decide what we like and what we don't like. Let's go to this post here. We can see that we have a caption, emojis, and it shows an image from our library. We can decide to approve this post or we can reject it. Let's approve this one. Now this post is ready for us to schedule out. And remember, this is also teaching the AI what you like. So we're also saying, make me more posts like this one. Let's go to another AI created post. Let's say that maybe we don't love this caption. We think it's a little long. It's just not our favorite. So we'll scroll down and select reject and that post will be removed from our database. And again, this is teaching the AI, I don't want posts like this.
the final place that you can find your AI assistant is in the reputation section. So let's navigate over to reputation and we want to make sure that we're in the reviews tab. We all know how important it is to respond to all of our online reviews, but it can get really time consuming, especially if we have a lot of reviews to answer. And we don't just want to say thanks for the review every time. We want to personalize them and show our customers that we care. Luckily, our AI assistant is here to make that happen. Let's go to a review that needs a response. Now I could just click reply and write my own response, or I can click the AI button and have it generate some responses for me. Now we can see we have all of these different responses to this review. They include the customer's name and even details from their review to really make it personal. I'm gonna choose this one. Click done and then post my reply. Now I've responded to a review with a thoughtful and personal response and it only took about 30 seconds. This also works for the not so great reviews. Let's find one of those. This review was left by a customer who didn't have the best experience, so we need to make sure that we respond appropriately. Once again, we're going to click the AI button and we see that we have a bunch of responses to this customer's negative review. Just like the positive responses, they include our customer's name and reference the details they included. Let's choose one and then post our reply. That concludes our Ralio AI training session. We hope that this video gets you excited to use this new tool and helps you create and post more engaging content and review responses. If you have any questions, reach out to our support team at support at Until next time, happy posting.